always be thinking how I'm going to go to the next level because I don't want to stay in this position. What's up people, it's your boy Andrew FAQ and today I'm going to be discussing five ways of understanding female nature. I'm excited for this one. Let's go! So there's two things that most guys will do sometimes in their life. The first one is heartbreak and sometimes marriage. So let's talk about the first one, heartbreak. Listen, heartbreak can be one of the most effective things when it comes to a relationship. It brings you down and most men don't know how to deal with this stress. Sometimes they don't want to eat and in the worst situation, they want to out themselves. Listen, when it comes to heartbreak, the only way to deal with it is to understand why it went wrong and how you're going to deal with it. I've gone through heartbreaks and how I dealt with it was to channel my energy into something that's going to benefit me in the long run. If I stuck myself in that, in that um, environment or in that feeling, I would end up doing something to somebody or to myself. So to get yourself out of that trap is to sort of put your mind into something that's going to help you progress. And I, I used the gym. I was in the gym literally twice a day. I tried to drown out all the thoughts of the heartbreak because if you get yourself in that bubble, it's not good for your health. You're mentally going to be drained. You're going to feel like you don't want to be here no more. And that's what can affect you even in your, your personal relationship, with your family, your relationship at work. You don't want to do it anymore because of the heartbreak. So to be proactive is going to help you deal with this heartbreak situation. You've got to be finding a way to come out of that bubble, that trap, that, you know, oh, the world is against me. That mindset, come out of it slowly. If you put that energy into something that's going to help you benefit, you're going to come out of that bubble. And the second point is marriage. Most of us in our life will experience some type of marriage, maybe down the line if you meet the woman that you want. And this can either be a good thing or can turn out to be the worst thing. I would say if you're going to go into marriage, make sure you're mentally prepared for it. Because nowadays people are, people are um, ad advised to marry just for, just for the fashion. You're getting married just for the fashion, but you're not getting married for the right reasons. And that's to stay together and build, and build a family together. People only getting married so they can show off on the internet. If you're going in the wrong reasons to marriage, you're going to it's going to fail, and, I, and it'll fail very quickly because if you pick the wrong woman, you're going to end up doing it just to please her, and once she pleases her egos and everything, she's going to end up leaving you in the dust, and that's when you're going to go back to point one, depression. You don't want to go back to that feeling. So if you're going to consider marriage in the future, make sure it's for the right reasons because. These things can crush you as a human, as a person. You don't want to be around no more. You're going to fall. My life is over because you gave all your love and all of your resources to this lady who has now come into your life and taken everything and moved on to another life. The blue pill are, are, are for marriage and the red pill are against marriage. Me, I'm in the middle. Like I say, if you find the right woman, do your thing. But you have to do your assessment very, very clearly because I'm telling you now, if you go in the marriage and you're doing the wrong thing, you're going to end up getting burnt. And the, when you get burnt, you're going to feel that. Trust me. So don't do it. So point number two is for understanding female nature. It will make you more masculine. You become more attractive when you become more masculine as a man. Becoming masculine brings out energy that attracts women anyway. Because women can sense who is a masculine guy and who is not a masculine guy. So once you understand their nature, the way they think, the way they move, how they text, their, their interests. Once you understand these things, you're going to become more confident when it comes to dealing with women. And those are the main things when it comes to dealing with women in this society because women have a short attention span because they're getting DMs from everybody, like from regular guys to celebrity, blue check guys. And you come in there now and they're like, I've got so many options. Why should I choose you? Listen, if a woman is not giving you that time, do not give her your time. Focus on you. Focus on your growth, your purpose, because that's how you're going to become more masculine and more into your energy. Focus on your energy. Protect your energy, guys. Listen, that's one thing. Protect your energy. Because if you're letting your energy go into anybody, you're going to lose your value slowly, 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 and you become one regular dude and any other dude that's been messaging her on the gram or the person that's catcalling her in the car. Don't be that person, mate. Trust me, you're going to feel it. Point number three for understanding female nature is gaining more game you will understand why they act like that why they behave like that but 
by breaking down all these little things of what females do and we come more and more understanding on why they do the things they do and once you understand why they do the things they do you're going to come prepared so when they say something to you to throw you off you're going to have a counter you're going to be like oh boom this is how you do that this is how you respond and once they see that you're in your energy they're going to become more and more attracted to you because they think i'm used to guys to just falling on their feet and giving me what they want but when you come in with that energy you're coming back you're snapping back at her like no this is how i'm I, we're going to do this she's going to be like wow this person knows his value and once you know your value guys you're going to become that you're going to become that person in her life that doesn't is not giving her anything she wants because she's beautiful trust me guys there are many beautiful girls out there there are many but there aren't many guys that can tell them no that's the thing be that guy that says no if she's, if she's doing wrong trust me because my, my, many guys will say yes to a girl that's doing wrong all the time so she'll never know how to change her behavior but if you be that guy that's different no i'm not do, i'm not gonna i'm not gonna do that she's gonna be that like, shit this guy is not having it she's gonna become more attractive to you because you know your worth know your value point number four to understanding female nature is self-improvement lads listen i can't stress how self-improvement is very key in terms of understanding female nature become addicted to self-improvement become addicted to always improving yourself on a daily basis lads listen there's no oh if i get to this point i'm going to ah oh, that's it i made it oh become addicted to always wanting to hit the next bar the next the next level because i'm telling you now don't stay in that zone because that lady will come in and she's always wanna she always wanna find the best guy that's available to her. So you always gonna be make sure that you're gonna be that best guy for yourself, not for her, for yourself. Keep improving yourself, self-improvement, getting fitter, getting your clothes on point, getting your look on point, getting your money on point. Make sure your finances are correct. Because when you come into that into the dating market, you're gonna be like, I hit all boxes. What do you bring to my table now? This is my table. What do you bring to my table? Because I've got all the boxes. What do you bring to my table? When you come like that, she's going to become correct. Because she'll be like, wow, this guy is actually a valued man. Listen, you want to become a valued man. And that's, and that's for yourself. Forget what she thinks. Once you understand your value, she's going to become more attracted to you. She's going to find you as the man, not the other guy. She's going to see you as that guy. So what you got to do is focus on self improvement self-improvement is key listen key to becoming the best man possible do not lack in that area always want to improve always want to become better than yesterday always look at something in the mirror and say how can i make you become better how can i make you become more financially free always be thinking how i'm going to go to the next level because i don't want to stay in this position you gotta be thinking shit if i stay in the position someone's gonna take my my kingdom always be thinking as like like instinct okay i've got to move to the next level i've got to get to the next level okay i've made that money let me double that money next year okay let me triple that money always aiming to improve yourself in every aspect of life do not get comfortable get comfortable being uncomfortable point number five for understanding female nature is to improve your relationship and that's not only with females in your work in your friendship you're gonna become more aware to toxic people and you can cut them off. You can you can highlight them from the start. Oh, this person just wants me for this. And you can drop them very quickly because you're understanding of their nature. And when you understand female nature, you can pick out if a woman is there for you, for you or for your money or just for status. You will understand that very quickly by the first what the first week of being of a woman you'll understand if she's there for you or just for what you have and if you understand all these traits you're going to become more and more masculine you're going to become more in your energy you're going to understand okay this is what this is my purpose i am here to do this if i find the right woman to come in on board she's got to come on board to help me grow i mean she's got to come on and become an asset not become a liability because when she becomes a liability you're going to crumble so you're going to become more better person you're going to find the right person by becoming more aware of female nature becoming more aware of female nature will help you improve mentally physically financially and you won't be in you know, that group where guys are just giving women money just for being just for being a lady like I just, i've seen it too much times that, that girls will be like yeah this guy just sent me a thousand dollars just for feet pick it's insane guys stop simping on females you are ruining their own manhood you're ruining the name of man <laughs> you're just ruining it you're you're getting you're making us become less valuable 
and women are coming in the market and think that guy there sent me sent me some some money just for doing something stupid. You can't be giving women your assets or your 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 valuables just because they're ladies. Make them work for it. Make them come into your life and bring value for you. So then you can be like, you know what? Because you did this, I'm going to award you by taking you somewhere nice, babes. You see? But if she's not giving you that, do not give her that. Don't be giving her that. Because now she'd be like, you just gave, you gave it to me for just for existing. Don't do that. And that's when that's a trap a lot of guys are falling into is giving women things that they don't deserve. Do not become part of that group. So that's five points of understanding female nature. I hope you enjoyed this video because this video is going to help you. You improve yourself. You're going to go back now and improve yourself. Like this video so other people can see what we're talking about and join the community. Till next time guys. Peace.